today we are heading to one of my all-time favorite places in California, wine country. <laughs> <laughs> it's everyone's favorite, Jess. Oh, yeah. I mean, it's like my Disneyland and one of the <laughs> best places there, Sonoma. It is oh. absolutely absolutely beautiful yeah yeah it is such a special place ladies and what's nice about it too it's a quick flight from LA and easy drive from the Bay Area which makes Sonoma the perfect getaway I love Sonoma County it's so beautiful here we're pretty laid-back people there's everything from the ocean to the mountains to the redwoods to the beautiful wine country we believe everyone is a little too connected in their everyday lives so we tell people to come here disconnect, recharge, breathe in the fresh air. What's wonderful about this whole region is that it's a potpourri of all that Sonoma County is. We have all of this, the ocean. It's what makes us specifically very unique. We have this incredible, wild Northern California coast at our ready. And obviously there's clearly enough space here for us to be and connect safely. As you wind your way along Highway 1, you'll see not only the breathtaking views of the rugged coastline, but as you enter Jenner, a stunning 93-foot high sculpture will greet you. The first thing about Benny Bufano is that he's a renowned sculptor who stepped way outside of the box in his time in the early 20th century. The Peace Obelisk, which was a piece that was installed and completed in 1963, speaks to hope over fears. And you can stay overnight here at a romantic spot called Timber Cove Resort. Most of the rooms have fireplaces and views of the ocean or surrounding forest. And not too far away, tucked in the Redwoods, is a small family-owned winery on land they've owned since the mid-1800s. Here you can enjoy wine and cheese pairings in the forest. I think what really sets us apart as a winery is that we are growing the grapes. My husband, Charlie, is legendary in the grape growing business, and my boys are involved, and my assistant winemaker, Kira, who's also a member of the family, and we go in and we are there from start to finish. And the climate is perfect for growing Chardonnay and even Pinot Noir. Pinot Noir is the heartbreak grape because it's kind of difficult to grow. I call it the diva of the grape world. It really likes specific temperatures. It grows really, really well out here in Sonoma County on the Sonoma Coast side. Another winery you won't want to miss is located in Windsor. It has a park-like setting with bocce ball and a garden holding 95 different types of roses. Brickler Vineyards is a family-owned family-run winery here in the Russian River Valley where we have amazing food wine experiences for people to come enjoy in a socially distanced outdoor fashion. With a reservation you can do outdoor wine tasting or a dinner experience or even take a yoga class. It's like reading a wonderful story Right, you know, you, there are these chapters to the county that comprise the entirety of the book, the story of what Sonoma County is all about. You can go for a bike ride to world-class wineries, go horseback riding and kayaking. It's fun just because you cut the water so fast, you get to see the wildlife, you get to see the sun, you can maneuver through the rapids in a nice way. The Russian River is really Sonoma County's great hidden gem of a resource. From this art exhibit of Salvador Dali that includes a stunning selection of sculptures and prints to wine tasting and incredible food. And you can enjoy a rejuvenating massage among beautiful gardens at Osmosis Day Spa Sanctuary. We are sixth generation family owned and operated. We are a vineyard, winery, and historic landmark farm stay in. Beltane Ranch has a long and really kind of interesting history. There was some important viticultural developments that happened in our vineyard. It was first planted in 1879. And then the property is a historic landmark because the main ranch house was built by a remarkable black woman from outside New Orleans. Her name is Mary Ellen Pleasant. You can stay overnight at the main house or private cottage that sits on 105 acres. Or you can even go glamping along a beautiful stretch of the Russian River, just 10 minutes from charming Healdsburg. There's a comfy bed with a queen-size mattress and linens. 
There are cots if you have children. There is electricity to charge your phones. There's clothing racks. There's a rug. There's a front deck with patio furniture where you can relax. We put a fire pit out in front. You have clean bathrooms. You have hot showers. You even have an outdoor kitchen where you can cook and prepare your meals. For families, one of the things they love is to have a fire, sit around, make s'mores, wait for the stars to come out. And don't miss out on cooling off in the river, inner tubing, swimming, or you can even fish. For us, it's a passion. It's why we love Sonoma County so much. It's the recreational, it's the outdoors, it's the wine. When you come here, you want to stay. You're here to stay for a while and to really explore and get to know its bones. We would love you to come visit us here in Sonoma County. Recharge, relax, reconnect with friends, and just take all the stress out of your life. Love to see you.